this Minnesota officer stops a young couple on the highway and uh, Philando Castle, rest in peace. And he asked for the license and registration. And the young man let him know, listen, I have a, a firearm, which I do have a license for it. He let him know ahead of time. And the officer said, I want to see license and registration right now. And as this young man went to reach for his pocket to grab his registration and license, he got shot four times, four times by this officer. And thank God, thank God, okay, thank God, that Diamond Reynolds posted this and live streamed this on Facebook. And still at that, and still at that, I hope and I pray to God that this officer goes to jail for life because he committed a murder. It's apparent. Yes, this is the aftermath. But not one time, not one time did he call her a liar. All he kept saying over and over was, Oh, I told him not to grab it. I told him not to reach for it. Motherfucker, you asked him to reach for it. You don't do that. No. You don't sit there and take a life of a human being. And she had to sit there and watch her fiancé die with a child in the back seat of the car. It is so heartbreaking. Oh, she's pleading for him not to die. Oh, she's pleading with the Lord. For him to stay here with them, with the family, with her. This is so devastating. And then you got fucking assholes talking about, oh man, I'm sick and tired of the Black Lives Matter bullshit and blah, blah, blah. Motherfuckers, you don't see that this is why it is so important. This movement is very important. This officer just committed murder. He did. Look at the footage. Stay with me. We got pulled over for a busted tail light in the back. And the police just, he's, he's, he's covered. He they killed my boyfriend. He's licensed. He's carried to, he's licensed to carry. He was trying to get out his ID and his wallet out his, um, pocket. And he let the officer know that he was, re he had a firearm and he was reaching for his wallet. And the officer just shot him in his arm. We're waiting for a back. I will, sir. No worries. I will. Fuck. He just shot his arm off. We got pulled yeah. over on Larpener. I told him not to reach for it. I told him to get his hand open. He had, you told him to get his ID, sir, and his driver's license. Oh, my God. Please don't tell me he's dead. Please don't tell me my boyfriend just went like that. Just keep your hands where they are, please. Yes, I will, sir. I'll keep my hands where they are. Please don't tell me this, Lord. Please, Jesus, don't tell me that he's gone. Please don't tell me that he's gone. Please, officer, don't tell me that you just did this to him. You shot four bullets into him, sir. He was just getting his license and registration, sir. Get the female passenger out. Madam, exit the car right now with your hands up. Let me see your hands. Exit now. Get on your knees. Get on your knees. They threw my phone, Facebook. Please don't tell me, Lord Jesus. Please don't tell me. Okay, please. No, please don't tell me my boyfriend. No, I'm gonna take it off my hand. Please don't tell me he's gone. Please, Jesus, no. Please, no. Please, no. Please, no. Don't let him be gone, Lord. What?
take it off. Please don't tell me my boyfriend's gone. He don't deserve this. Please. He's a good man. He works for St. Paul Public School. He doesn't have no records of anything. He's never been in jail, anything. He's not a gang member, anything. I'll take care of that, okay? Can you just stand right here for me? Go ahead. Okay. Come right there, then. Is that, is that your phone? We in the back seat of the police car. Phil's sister called me. The police just shot my boyfriend for no apparent reason. My phone is about to die. They shot him. He shot him three times because we had a busted tail light. He asked him for license and registration. He told him that man that it was in his wallet, but he had a like a pistol on him because he's licensed to carry. And the officer told him don't move. And as he was putting his hands back up, the officer shot him in his arm about four or five times. I'm on Larpenter and Fry. Whoever can come to Larpenter and Fry, that's where I'm at. I'm going to need a ride home. We is on Larpenter and Fry. Alize, if you can come to Larpenter and Fry, we right here in Roseville. We got the Roseville police. They got me handcuffed. My phone is about to die. I'm on Larpenter and Fry. The, the, the Roseville police department just shot my boyfriend. They shot him four times. He's licensed to carry. We had a busted tail light. And we had some weed in the car. That's about it. It was a Chinese police officer that shot him. He's Chinese. He's about five, 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 six and a half. Heavy set guy. He asked him for his license and registration, which was in the back of his pocket, because he keeps his wallet in his pocket. And as he went to reach, he let the officer know before he was reaching that he had a firearm on him. And before he can let the officer know anything, the officer took off shots. About four or five rounds was shot. And my boyfriend, I don't know what condition he's in. I don't know if he's okay or if he's not okay. I'm in the back seat of the police hand car, in the back seat of the police car, handcuffed. I need a ride. I'm on Larpenter and Friday. Got machine guns pointed. Don't be scared. My daughter just witnessed this. The police just shot him for no apparent reason. No reason at all. They asked for license and registration. That's the police officer over there that did it. With the black on. I can't really do shit because they got me handcuffed. I can't believe they just did this. I'm fucking... Fucking fire! Ah! It's okay. I'm right here 
Please, Lord, y'all please pray for us, Jesus, please, y'all. I ask everybody on Facebook, everybody that's watching, everybody that's tuned in, please pray for us. Sister, I know I just dropped you off, but I need to be picked up. I need Alizé to call my phone. 